my friends, uh, welcome. This is Market Commentary with uh, Axiori. And this week uh, starts with important information from UK. Apparently Rishi Sunak will be the next uh, Prime Minister uh, after Boris Johnson quit the uh, race. Uh, and uh, well, we don't have a big uh, reaction on the market. Uh, so let me show you Euro to uh, British Pound. Uh, where you can see that uh, British pound is really mixed. Uh, I could also, of course, uh, show you cable, but uh, definitely cable is under the influence of the uh, of the stronger dollar. Uh, so here you have uh, British pound uh, compared to uh, to euro. Uh, no big uh, reaction uh, really on uh, on this uh, instrument. And let's see what will happen when this information will be confirmed. Uh, next uh, one is the GDP uh, print from uh, China, which came better than expectations. We got 3.9, uh, 3.3 uh, uh, was expected. What was interesting is that this data was postponed, uh, so uh, many experts uh, were uh, thinking that it was postponed because it was much worse than expectations, but uh, it happened to be uh, much better. Uh, this should be a positive information for uh, stocks. Although today uh, stocks started higher, of course, but from the very beginning we have a uh, we have a drop. Mm, so indices are going uh, down, and in the first half of the European session, this is the S&P 500. Uh, here we have an interesting situation. So invest in a shoulder formation, breakout of the neckline that could be a strong buy signal. But if the price will come back below the neckline, that will be a false breakout, and that would be an amazing sell signal. So definitely Monday will be. Uh, will be important for uh, indices and after today we should get a proper signal so price uh, climbing uh, above the neckline that will be a signal to buy and a price dropping below the neckline that would be a signal to sell thanks very much for watching and i wish you all the best in your trading